I used to watch television to, to uh, waste time. And I don't consider Zentangle a waste of time, but I have, I have since stopped watching television. It's just not a part of my life anymore. And it has, has freed me to um, open up, open up a, a, a huge amount of, of, of time in my life so that I can uh, dedicate it to this art. I am, um, I was a math major in college and I've spent all of my career working with computers. I build what is commonly called as the cloud, so I build clouds. I have been working in, uh, I've been teaching uh, internet, the invisible part of the internet for 25 years and I do not consider myself an artist. The friend who gave us the Zentangle lesson is a, is a well-regarded artist and uh, she's shown in galleries and, uh, and when she proposed giving us an art lesson, I uh, hung back a little bit and she uh, drew me out of my shell. Uh, so uh, she said, anyone can do this. And she put a dot on a piece of paper and said, do you think you can handle that? I said, yes, I think I can draw a dot. And then she put a line. She said, do you think you can handle that? I said, I think I can handle that. And she put the rest of the basic strokes of uh, Zentangle on a piece of paper, and there are only five of them. And I thought, I can do that. Um, and I really, uh, at the time in my life, I had a, a series of uh, what I call life's ambushes. And uh, it, uh, it, it shook my confidence. I, I had, um, I had been an, been an entrepreneur and uh, I was used to uh, figuring things out. And uh, when life ambushed me, I came up uh, upon some things that I just couldn't figure out. So I was having what I call a, a crisis in confidence. And this was a, a, new, uh, a new direction for me. And I found that it, it was uh, particularly calming and uh, since I already knew, knew something about teaching, I felt that I could become a CZT and I could teach and I could, I could tell people uh, some, of the, some of the successes that I had and I found that I could do this. So it doesn't just require someone with an artistic background and I found that uh, I, can, I, I can be rather artistic. It, it, it brought out the creative side of me that had been hidden all of my life.